Hello guys, in this video I want to show you how you can label and refer to tables, figures and equations in your document. So uh, the code here in this tag file is the same as in the previous videos. We are just adding this new package AMS Math. Okay. We already have seen how to label uh, a table. So here we are building a table and we place the label here. To refer to this table, we use the ref function here and use the same label. Let's see for figures here. It's the same. We put a label, in this case, fig colon eu6 here to refer to these figures ref backslash ref big colon eu6 let's run this document now first of all uh, you can see here that we have this uh, double question mark here and also here so in this case just uh, run again the document. And now, as you can see, this is a fix. So table one, and as you can see, it's linked. So this is table one, figure one, figure one. Now let's see equations. We use the environment begin equation and we place a label. So in this case, uh, equation here, uh, simple equation, eq column simple underscore equation. So here, solve equation, ref and backslash ref, eq column simple underscore equation. Okay, let me here a two. So solve equations. So we have a uh, one, two, we can place this dash and this is the outcome. Just let me run again. This is the one, two, for example. But now uh, we can refer to equation just with the number in parentheses. If we want to do this, we need to use backslash eqref, and this is from the package amsmat. And as you can see, this is the output. Let me uh, enlarge. So as you can see, solve equation 1, solve equation 1, 2, solve 1. Okay, now I want to talk about the role of tilde. Tilde represents an unbreakable space. What does that mean? Look here, I have some text here. Then we have table one, and here I have a figure, and one is in the next line. Then we have equation one, two, Equation 1, 2, equation 1, 2, and then I have an equation and 1 on the next line. And basically, this is wrong. We don't want this output. How do we fix it? With tilde. So now tilde is the Spanish accent, and if you follow the R series, is the symbol that we use as a regression operator. So what we have to do basically here, you see, we have table. What we have to do, we have to place a tilde. Yeah. Okay. So we do like this, like this.
and here. Now, if we run again, and as you can see, we have table one, figure one on the same line. Also, for equation equation one here on the same line, and this is how we should do that. So that's all for today, and if you enjoyed this video, see you in the next one.